I was very busy helping Mahler. We're very busy courthouse today. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Here I am, Jonas. So, so guys. Oh, my God. It's so, it's so hot. Seriously, I may have to go open the window. But, like, now, see, I have, now I have pop. <laughs> Everything together, together. Oh my god. Wow, guys. Oof. Oh, <laughs> so, oh my god, you guys, it's like a lot of running, running. So. Something strange about the blue today. Anyway, I'm always like, oh, double checking. Maybe I need to spray. I need to spray. One second. So, oh my God. Jonas needs spray on face. Oh, make it look better. Anyway. Yeah, because before, I guess, the, they didn't have the blue eyes, right, guys? So interesting. Um, it looks a little weird to me, but that's okay. You know, getting used to it. Getting used to it. It's okay. I always expect, you know, the guys, you know, sometimes I have to say, I have to remind myself, sometimes the makeup is not perfect, but it's like, you know, it's a, it's a trial and error, you know, experimenting. Jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle all the entitlements. Oh, my God. So, <laughs> so your car phones. If I'm happy about the events, they know it's like so much happening, right? So much happening. It's not even funny. You know, it's like, can you imagine everything that happened today? It's crazy. And yeah, I know, guys, I know that we what we really want. It's something that is a little bit more like more, we you know, I think, for example, a Kushner indicted or something like that. But I feel like this is the kind of thing that only people like them, you know, the prosecutors who have the, you know, he's, it, I think this is a masterful stroke because it's the combination of all these different things, right? It's like they all wrapped up. And I really believe, you know, the, the thing, the connection between the, uh, the Deutsche Bank thing, and then also the, the law offices in, in Chicago. And then, you know, if you think about it, guys, uh, what's his name? Michael Cohen spoke to Mueller supposedly for for uh, 70 hours. I'm sure he knows a lot, okay? He knows so much stuff, tons of stuff. Why, you know, it's so interesting. But then Mueller chose to discuss this, this area, you know? It's so interesting, right? Out of all of the things you could have done, he decided to talk about. You had building, yeah? <laughs> building Russian, yeah? Really? No? You sure? <laughs> really? Oh. <sighs> so, so it's it's like seriously, you know what I mean? And uh, and uh, oh my god, I kind of so funny this thing. It's kind of funny. I like it now. Dropping. I have hair. What is that? There's a whip it. I, you know, there's a song by the, what's the daughter of the guy, um, Willie. What is it? Whip it. So whip, whip the handcuff. Do you, yeah, no, no. It's like, you know, but there's like a young woman's song. Whip my, yeah. Whip my brain. Yeah. But I've never heard. I just. Yeah. So. So, yes, it's true. You know, he hasn't been sent, you know, all those things. I've supposedly whipped my, that's right, Willow Smith whipped my hair. That's right. So, so anyway, guys. So, so here we are. A lot to discuss. A lot to discuss today. But I, like I said, anyway, so I was just going to say that this whole thing about what Mueller mentioned, okay, the whole thing is like, um, so the crime is that he lied about this project keep going on. You know, I was thinking he could have said so many things. He could have said, well, I did go to Prague. I did go to this, do, do these things. So, but then he didn't, you know, it's almost as if it's the kind of thing, guys, and we'll look into the cards. I'm sure to us, you know, obviously it's meaningful, but to Trump, can you imagine? It must, oh my God, that's right. Trump has to face, ah, 
I love it. Oh, if it is what you say it is. I love it. I love it. If it came from WikiLeaks. I trust it. My daddy said, yeah. <laughs> so he's him. You know how he has this whole thing about humiliation? You know how he's like, like the whole thing about him is that is that he likes to know I'm great. Right. I am great. You say I'm great. Just say I'm great. Yeah. The whole thing is like image. So if he feels like he's, he's doing, it's like embarrassing, then it's like, oh, huh, oh, uh, uh, oh. So no, I'm not going. He look at me weird. Oh, <laughs> he look at me weird. <laughs> So, yeah, you know, so it's like people are looking at, I mean, nobody like this is the weird thing. It's like nobody likes him. That's a fact, right? Nobody likes him. Even the people who are criminals, they don't like him, right? So then they like well, looking at him weird normally because nobody likes him. Like, oh, that guy. And then now knowing this, they're like, mm hmm. We love you. <laughs> it's like, no. See you later. But as a dunno, see you later. But as a dunno, <laughs> so oh my god. Okay, so guys, that you know, it's funny. I I'm glad the, uh, because of course this this brought this all this stuff broke before twelve today. Okay, so I made notes, made many notes. Okay, so so I it's like because you know this is a very interesting facts. Okay, so oh and by the way, we'll like to make announcements. Tomorrow, you know, I have my friend, I have a friend's birthday, okay? Cynthia, I don't know. I see everybody's comments. I don't know what happened. There's nothing weird. I don't know. Maybe you refreshed it, okay? Anyway, so I just wanted to say that tomorrow I have a friend's birthday party at 7, but I know tomorrow is going to be the day that Paul Manafort is going to be, you know, Mueller is going to discuss what, what's happening. So I need to, I need to do it. I need to do a live stream. So what is going to happen is that I know many of you will not be able to make it. I'm going to do it 5.30, okay? And I know probably many of you won't be able to, but I feel like I have to do it because there's going to be so many news. I don't want to not do it. You know what I mean? There's Unless it's like a, like nothing happens, okay? Well, no, no, tomorrow is nothing. You know, but I think tomorrow is going to be a very, very big day, so I'm going to have to do a couple hours earlier, okay? So, so then, you know, because by the time I come back, it's like 11 o'clock. That's too late. You know what I mean? That's like, that's too late. So yeah, so to the, so I'm going to send out the same thing, but just, you know, let you guys know. Okay. All right. So then let's hear the, okay. So oh my God, so much stuff. Okay. Let me just now talk about, I made the notes. So of course you read all the news, but the question now it's like the interesting thing is the questions. Okay. So then, okay. So then Michael pl plus guilty to the whole thing about Russia project, Deutsche Bank raided, Chicago law firm raided it, tax returns for Trump's businesses. Okay. So then, um, I'm trying to think. So then I'll just, I'll just read what I've written here. What is Felix Sater's role? What is Deutsch's role in the Russia issue? Okay, because we, it happened at the same time. And is this investigation connected to Trump? Well, well I think it is. Now it's pretty clear it is. Now the other question is, is this connected to... How is this going, like, what does this mean for Trump? Okay, maybe this is a good place for us to start. How does it mean for, what does it mean for Trump that this stuff happened today? Okay, this whole thing was masquerade about the, the stuff in Russia and the Russia kind of media. Now, it's almost, but but connected to this, guys, and almost more, in more it's not more important, but it's maybe very interesting as well, is the whole thing about Deutsche Bank. Because as I posted earlier, the connections are crazy, okay, because you see, that there is a okay i wrote it that we have trump got all these loans from deutsche bank one justin kennedy uh uh justin kennedy justice kennedy's son was working there giving out all these loans and then three jo uh, kushner got all these loans okay all these loans crazy so we have to figure out how is this going to impact all these people and then and then okay and then okay and then it's like okay do not try why Mueller made this public now? What slash who this will affect? This affect how this will, this is basically how does this affect Trump's family? Kushner, Don Jr. Yeah, Don Jr. is having a great day today. Yeah, 
I hear his his party. He's so happy celebrating. <laughs> and then uh, what is you know what is what is going to come up here with the Deutsche Bank and also the law firm. This is interesting. The Chicago law firm, okay, because they were for 12 years they did Trump taxes and and by the way I think it coincides with with Michael Cohen, okay, as well because he was. Because my God, it was the, I don't know who the hero was today because somebody uh, before he boarded, uh, he somebody was asking questions. So I was just the whole day I had the TV, the thing streaming, but now I wasn't watching, just doing other things. And then somebody asked, President, he's like, I didn't do anything, no, nothing. Uh. And then somebody's like, So President Trump, is it, if he's so dumb, if Michael Cohen is so dumb and is is a horrible person, why did you work? Why did he work for you for twelve years? So like, hello, yeah, really. Yeah. Yeah, no. Yeah. Well, because I he I I promised to do something for him. Yeah. I was going to do something for him. So, okay. So that's it, guys. Okay, so let's let's get started. It has a lot to discuss today. A lot to discuss today. I'm sorry. I have no hairstyle today. Yeah, only the best people, exactly. Only the best people. Huh. Hello, President. Oh, my God. If it is what you say it is, I love it. I love it. Oh my! No, I know Sally. It will just work. That's the law firm. So I'm, that's what I'm talking about. The law firm. Yeah, guys, can you imagine the freak out? And then you know, so he boarded his flight, and mid-flight he canceled the meetings they had. Yeah. Now wonder, really? Oh, I wonder. That's so interesting. Yeah. Really? Why? Huh. Yeah, just like, oh my God. Oh, <laughs> so great for him. <laughs> so, okay. All right, guys. So, anyway. All right. So, I'm going to go. I'm going to disappear for a moment. Okay, so let's ask questions. Oh my God, this is complicated. It's so funny. I have paw. I have, I have to make sure the card is not lost inside the paw. <laughs> oh. Oh my God. Okay, so so tell us what your card is universe. Tell us what it means. Okay, how this is going to impact and the whole the whole basically the whole I think guys, you know, essentially, you know, not just the Mueller investigation, but the whole what's going on in public, right? The public opinion, the public opinion and the public face of the Mueller investigation. Because uh, I got a receipt, I was talking to a mystic, uh, mystery wrote me a message today. She was talking about, she's like, oh, I think maybe don't worry about the dates. You know, I think actually your dates may have been accurate because those people were indicted a while back. We're only finding out now. So it's actually an important thing, you know, regardless of whether this was, you know, this happened when or not, when the, the, find, the actual indictment happened. I just wanted to say that I think it's important. What I really want to know also is how this impacts, because, you know, Trump is always bullshitting in public. But what we want to know is how this impacts his standing, you know, in general. OK, like the, the, the public discourse about this, because his, his whole thing is about hijacking the public discourse. And once he loses the power, that's when he feels weak. OK, so. Yeah, exactly. Also, meeting with one. But let's see here first. I don't want to, guys, you know, this, uh, let's do, maybe, let's, I don't want to necessarily ask about the, because, you know, th this is for tomorrow. Let's do tomorrow, the JG20 meeting, because that happens tomorrow. Today, I just want to really focus on what came out, because it's a lot. We have to process it, okay? And how this is going to impact the standing of the Mueller investigation going forward, okay? Because, um, Exactly. And then also, I was, I was thinking this is also, um, yeah, this is really the big question I have about this. How does this impact the standing of the, and what was Mueller's goal with it, with everything? Okay. They go, oh, maybe there's a card that fell. Yeah. I feel like Mueller has a goal. What is the goal with this? And this is the question, you know, stuff that we don't know. So apologies. Oh my God. Yeah.
Holly, I, you know, I don't want to go into, like, let's try to, I don't want to focus into what he will do. It's not relevant what he does. It's about, the reading is about the, the Mueller investigation, how it impacts the, the because like whatever he does, he's always, he always has this like bullshit. He always bullshits. He's always going to create as much bullshit. You know, guys, don't worry. Don't worry. You're like already going to the fear mentality. You know what I mean? Because you're buying to this idea that he's so powerful. I don't think this is a thing. For, stop out. Like, don't worry about his, what he's going to do. Let's see how it's going to change and how this is going to impact him. Like, I feel like I don't want to even ask the question. You know, I don't even really want to ask the question about from like, oh, what is it going to do as if he's like, he's not, he's not God. You know, this is what I think. And it's like, eventually the curtain's going to fall. You know what I mean? So exactly. Arresting Donald Trump. That's it. It's not really like the I, you know, we seem to have been hijacked by this man and he's like always controlling the narrative. He doesn't control the narrative. It's over. Bitch. I ate him. Have you seen President Trump? No, because it's my stomach. <laughs> so, you know, so it's like, that's it. Okay. That's like what he's going to do. Who cares about him? You know, he's, he's, he's literally having diarrhea right now. He's having diarrhea. I mean, guys, can you imagine if you've committed all these crimes? I'm sure that something you must have had, like you must have some sort of heart, like something, you know, it's like, get over yourself. It's <laughs> I have diarrhea because the tooth came out. I have diarrhea because the truth came out <laughs> so okay yeah exactly he's weaker than co exactly <laughs> because the truth came out <laughs> so okay so so there's a constant reference so what does this mean for the Mueller investigation going forward you know in, in terms of the public perception of the Mueller investigation going forward and how this is going to factor. So I'm sure the cards are going to, going to have information. Well, let's 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 look. let's look at this. Okay, so Okay, so let's see here. Oh, interesting. <laughs> Guys, this card is great. Look, this card is the, this is a getting what you want, but it's upside down. So you got what you wanted, huh? Now is the price. Here's the price. Yeah, bitch. You're going to pay the price. <laughs> what else? Oh, look, changes. Things are changing. Yeah, they are. They are changing. Oh, guys, this is great. Quid pro quo upside down. So he owes something. Yeah. Things are changing. Yeah, things are changing. Look, because this guy's so funny. Look, it's like really like it's kind of funny. Like the fall. so you could see, <laughs> you could see here the change, and then getting he got just oh guys, I also have more. I have fingers, fingertips. <laughs> Look, my fingers. I have fingers. My cigarette f green fingers this time. Hmm? This is good. <laughs> just one for the pointing. Hello. <laughs> I like it. Hello, hi. So, so you can see here. Oh my God, that this is the getting what you want, but it's upside down. So, the the price of getting what you want, and here is the quid pro quo upside down. So he he is the beggar, right? So <laughs> the price for the getting what you want. There's a price, yeah. So, there's price, bitch. Yeah, there's price. <laughs> So, oh, hello. Uh -huh. Oh, I'm thinking. Oh, uh -huh. so, so anyway, so, um, okay. All right. So guys, okay. So then now let's see here. Now we're going to, this is just, so that wasn't mean for them. Okay. So, oh, essentially guys, what Mueller is getting to is really the quid pro quo because that's really the essence here. Right. And as I was listening to the, everybody on the, you know, television or whatever, and that was the thing. It's like, well, what this, not just, it's pretty clear that, okay, this is, let's see here. Oh, look, this is the government. Could also be the legal, you know, the, oh, look. Oh, da -da. oh aggression. Okay. Oh, interesting. I love it, guys. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Okay. 
this is a great guy because you know Ola Normand is always about like card combinations is more important than the cards alone. Ola Normand, okay. So basically, what we have here is aggress. This is a whip is aggression. Government. And this is family. So the government is going to act very aggressively towards the family, right? Not just his family, but I think anybody who's connected to him in his art chart is going to now finally. Yeah, it's you, you. Hey, look. Woo, President. Ah! So, I'm sorry, I'm such a freak. Like, uh, I'm a child. You know, there was a, there's a movie, 13 going on 30. You know that movie? There's like I'm a little older than thirty, but like <laughs> I'm like I'm like eight going on uh something. I'm not telling my age, no, because you still like romance. So so anyway, guys. So so basically, yeah. The 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 government now changed the the uh, the story, right? So it's like they're going to act very aggressively towards the family. Okay. <laughs> All right, so then let's so shuffle the cards. Guys, it's so funny shuffling this because I don't even know what the cards are. It's kind of funny. It's like, oh, I hope I can pick up the cards that don't get lost in the fur. Okay. Okay. <laughs> oh my God. Apes. <laughs> It's so funny. It's so true. My kid, she said, my kid. <laughs> stop. I don't want to have a laugh. I don't want to have a laugh attack. But how she said, my kids think I'm crazy. <laughs> I'm watching the lion show. <laughs> my kid. <laughs> Oh my, oh my god, it's going to ruin makeup. I don't know. No, no, oh my god. All sad news. I'm so sad for him. Sad for him. Oh my god, look. Oh no, look, it's me crying. Look, do I look? It's me. I'm crying for you, President. I really am. But look, the woman's not actually crying, she's pretending. Uh huh. Mm, bitch. I'm crying, all right. Mm hmm. <laughs> Oh my god, okay. So okay. <laughs> Don't cry. That's why I forgot I said it's so true. Oh my god. Don't cry from me, Argentina. Remember how I used to say Don't cry from me, Argentina? Oh yeah. Oh look, this is the, the guy, the justice guy. So the, the man is like, bitch. This one looks like Maria Butina, don't you think? <laughs> anyway, so it's um this is <laughs> This is the writing something for you. I'm writing, huh? Sad news. Yeah. <laughs> um, oh, oh no. No, no. Stop, stop. Oh no, no, no. Look, oh. Because it's like, it's so interesting if you look at it. <laughs> oh my God, look, If I, it's funny because if I go, I look at him, the guy, look, he's writing the note and the note is, sad. so see he's writing, okay, here he's writing the note. Let me show you this close. He's writing the note here, right? So, <laughs> and then the person receives the note here. Then the, the he wrote the note and then he re the woman's reading the note. Oh no, sad news. What is the news about other than sad? It's over. It's over. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, no. Sad for him. Sad for him. So. Okay. So, so then, okay. So this is here. Let's see here. What else? Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> It's so funny. <laughs> okay. So... <laughs> I'm having a laugh attack. No, 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 not true, not true. Okay. 
Okay. So let's see what here. Let's see what the if I can bury that's like really I cannot see. Okay, so let's see what the card is saying. What is what's the reveal? Oh, living room. Private. Yeah? Mm-hmm. Oh yeah. <laughs> Private. Oh, that's the girlfriends. <laughs> Yeah, interesting because this is also a time card, guys. It's, it's something imminent. But it could also be private communications. Yeah. <laughs> I'm crying inside the hotel. This is gloomy thoughts. So he's very regretful. He's like, I'm like, we're like, President, why don't you take another step and jump? Don't worry, you can always jump. Don't take your time, but consider there is a sea you could jump. You fall. Thank you. So, <laughs> so. <laughs> Don't take, oh, look, oh, my God, look. How do we go? How do we go? Look, how do we go? There he is. The Justice Department has the resolutions. So it's interesting, guys. So, so oh, you know, this, guys, you know what? This this goes with something I'd seen, I've been seeing, that he may has, have already received, he's, he's panicking because he already received notices from the Justice Department, okay? And if you look at this, okay, well, let, let me just finish. <laughs> I have more cards. Oh, yeah. <laughs> more cards. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, the President, you know, you can always go watch the sea. Make sure you put, you know, some oil on your or a sneaker, outside sneaker, so you can slide and fall. Don't worry. Don't worry. Oh, my God. Okay, let's see here. What else? What a little heavier. Okay. <laughs> it really looks like a monster. Oh my god, okay, here. What do we have? What do we have here? Oh, oh no. Oh, guys, look, this is so interesting. This card is the malady. So this is sickness, but this is a very serious sickness. When it's upside down, okay, it's it means it increases the meaning, okay? So it gets worse. So it's very sad. He's sick. Oh, he gets sicker. Oh guys, look, this is the this is the you know when it's upright, it billeto dolce that means love note. It's upside down, it means a very bad news message that is very sad for him. Uh-huh. Oh guys, look, that card that I've talked to you before about, it's called absence. It's not that hello president. President, president, I want to tell you something. Can I call President? No, he's not here anymore. He's over. He, he's over. Yeah, he's over. Bye. Yeah, so. You guys, don't get started with this whole Pence story. I've already talked about it. Don't even get started with the whole thing about it. You, you don't think that, please don't, don't get me started with Pence thing. He's over too. He's gone. When he's like, he's not going anywhere. Yeah. So anyway. So okay, so then guys, he leaves. This is, he, but this is not news. If you've been following the, the whole, if you've been following what I have saying, but this, okay, he leave, he's gonna leave. I think this is very clear here. Okay, that's what it shows now. Okay, so then let's see here, and then let's see what else so is happening now. Okay. Oh, melancholia. That's right. He's sad. Oh, he's so sad. He's so sad for him. Past. This is interesting, right? That's they. Oh, they went after the past, right? And then, oh, oh, that's it, guys. That's it. He's gone. This is the second. Okay, this is very important. Very important for marathons. Very important. So, guys. Okay, guys. There's something very important. Okay, that I. Oh, I'm seeing here. Very important. I have to. I have to talk about it. So, is it okay? I hate this, like the hate. Okay, that's it. Much better. Oh, much better. That's it. That's found solution. Found solution. So, guys, okay, very important here. Okay, um, he's gonna leave. This is the first thing before I even show you the cards. Well, I've been showing you the cards anyway, but it is the most clear thing that that is showing here is that he's leaving. Okay, he's leaving. He he's saying. Uh, actually, I love, I like you uh, here, job, uh, but I, you don't pay me enough. I need to enjoy my life later. So I'll say goodbye to you. 
there because guys okay this is very important okay again now not enough light too much light i don't know so anyway so i just want to this is this is important guys okay let me show you the columns let me show you the last column because that's the most that's what i see that he's going to leave okay so this is the that would be probably the final outcome so this is the quid pro quo right that what he owes the family this is the the tree is the family so he owes something and so does the family so the whole family is compromised and i think this the tree here means not just the family his associates and there's a coffin so everybody who is who owes something right who has the quid pro quo so so this is it he the the coffin the ending comes to them okay here we have right and the next so then comes the justice department so so they owe this money they found them the they're surviving for this money there is an ending through the justice department and this guys this is the card that i told you before this is a card of absence right so he leave what so what how does this how is does he become absent this is what i'm to tell you this card here is the constant upside down so constant upright is something that goes on for a long time up upside down it doesn't last you see what i'm saying so so this to me is really a very because it's said many times in many different ways there's three different cards that indicate there's the coffin which is like an ending but there's many ways that the ending could happen and it shows an absence because he leaves he resigns he walks away okay so when he they get you know how it's like oh don't touch the money don't touch the money don't touch money don't go there this is my house and then they go there and they're like oh I have to go by, you know, he, he claims to be so powerful, but that's his weak point. And there is once the Justice Department gets this, you know, finds the debt. OK, in other words, the, 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 the evidence of the quid pro quo, then he leaves. That's what it looks like. OK, that's what it looks like. So so I just wanted to say this is just the outcome. OK, and so since it's very clear here. And it, it, you know, it was actually very nuanced in many ways as well. Um, he leaves. Okay, now, uh, what was I going to say? So because we have, some, you know, the I, and I feel like we could ask, you know, let, I'll just say like, okay, you could say, well, there's the Justice Department here. Could he be kicked out? Could he, you know, it, it essentially, say, I believe it's voluntary. Okay, because here we have the absence, somebody leaving. There's something that it's like it shows that he, he at some point he realizes that he can't. I can't take it no more. No, I I I need to go golf more. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I need more golf. I need a retara, retara menta. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> so okay, so then let's see here. Okay, now let's go back to the other cards just to give you the context. So then here we something changing, yeah changing a lot of things are changing this is aggression okay so it's almost guys as if trump is dealing with the aggression you know the whole life he was agreed he's like now the government is getting harsh that's what it's showing okay the government is harsh now but is that not you have you have a nightmare today why <laughs> imagine i'd love to go give you a nightmare later yeah Mm -hmm. So, so I'm so silly. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. So then, okay. So then we have here. This is gloomy thoughts. So he's very regretful, right? So it's almost as if the moment he realizes that those people are bigger than him. He's like I said, guys. I've talked about the Chihuahua syndrome. He barks really loud, but when the time comes, when the government really shows, and they're like, he's like, oh no, oh no. Then he receives the set, the negative news. I think this is the meaning some sort of indictment document related to an indictment oh this is on top actually the justice person writes a document right this is the person writing look the 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 judge person writes something then he receives the this is a person receiving the letter and it's negative and it has to do with his past because this is a part of the past right so there's exactly that his past relationships with the russians okay and then this is the, this is a card, guys. Also of luxury. I remember, you know, one of one of the first readings I did on the channel also about. I remember it was about Manafort. I remember this really well. It said, "Oh, as I said something like he spent too much money, and it's sort of like luxury, you know, overspending and you know, all those kinds of things." Okay, so so this is it. It's like he got. Oh, God, yeah, you want to want election, huh? You want election? Yeah, I think so. 
and this is the government, right? So he got what he wanted, got the government, could be the law too. And then, but then this is sad news. There's sad news for him in private, okay? Or about, you guys, this could also be his private life, okay? Then we have here, he's sick. He goes crazy. He's sick. I don't think he's pretending. I think he really is sick. He goes, he goes insane, okay? In some way. And then he's sad. I'm glad I said, oh, oh. <laughs> so, so that's it, guys. Essentially, what this is saying is that that's it. That he's gonna leave. It it got to his past. The thing that he really that he really is very sensitive for. Who is sensitive for me? Yeah. You don't like children concentration camps? Yeah. Huh? You crying? Not yet. <laughs> Not started. <laughs> So, you know, so it's kind of like, you don't like to call people names, huh? Yeah, you have a problem with that? Are you a snowflake? No, you're not a snowflake, I think, huh? You're a tough guy, huh? <laughs> so, so, okay, oh, guys, this kind of hurts because it's, you know, squishing the finger. So, so now, okay, so then we understand this is the end. It's like he goes to stuff that it's like he wants to leave. Got it. Okay. So now, now let's see about the, I under, guys, you know, it seems very final here. I'm trying to think, okay, so next let's look at how this, how this impacts. Um, you know, I think, okay, this is the thing that I got from this reading. Then I just looked at the spread that Mueller got the quid pro quo evidence of quid pro quo already. And this is it. It's over quid pro quo took, took over. Okay. That's one thing. Now, second thing is, I think we need to ask how this is. Now, I want to know about how this is going to impact um, each Jared Don Jr. and his family, okay? Right? Because I think it's not enough that he leaves. Obviously, we want indictments with these people. The other thing I want to know is also about the Deutsche Bank separately and Justin Kennedy, Okay, because Justin Kennedy, right? We need to know, like, is this going to impact the the Supreme Court? What is happening? Okay, so so, but now let's just uh, now we find out what happens to Trump. But let's now go to the kids. Oh, well, let's go to Jared. Jared, are you happy? Oh no, the family upside down. Right? So this impacts the family negatively. Oh, this is fighting aggression. So he's fighting something. Really, the fi the family is going to have to fight. Really. Oh no. So they're this is beginning. They're gonna start to execute something. <clears throat> okay, so I'm so sorry for them. They're great people. No, I think they're great. Huh. They are. So okay, so then we have here. Oh, this is interesting, right? This is an offer because also be bribery, guys. Okay, so oh look, the child, right? So Trump make a Trump bribery. Okay, let's see. Let's see. This is Jared, okay? Oh, interesting. So everything becomes public. Now this is the child offering becomes clear. So it's interesting. Okay, let's see more. Because this would indicate, yeah, this is changes, something changes, yeah? But really, why? Oh, here's a false person. Oh, is it? Hmm. Let's see. Because of, well, this is interesting. So the guy has money on the table, okay? So, yeah, I think here's, he is the key. I think we know that, okay, that he's the key to money. So a false person, look, there's this seat connected to a change and the ch the person who paid for this change. I think this is, I. so far it looks like, obviously, this is, we know, it's not new, right? That Jared is the key to bribery and crimes. Oh, wow, look, guys, so interesting. So, so this, you see, this is again, sad news, but it's the same system. This is also a skipper like the other one, but in the same row, the same position, Kushner gets exactly the same sad news. Oh, what is it? oh. so then we have here meetings. Now this could also mean cooperation, but let's see, this is meeting. I don't know if he was at that meeting, guys, the Trump tower, everybody was at that meeting. This is business deals, right? Yeah, so I think we we figure out we find out all the money that he got. Yeah, look, <laughs> this finger is so fun. Yes, yeah, so 
we find the money that he got from these business deals, okay? And then, okay, so then we have Riororos. Oh, oh, this is uh, something unpleasant. Yeah, it is unpleasant. Really? Very unpleasant. What happened? Oh, yeah, something shady. Foreign tra travel upside down. So, yeah, we know. Something very unpleasant about abroad. Oh, look, gamblers, guys. So interesting, right? So, yeah, so it's this larger. This is a group of people. It could also be gambling in terms of illegal money. Okay, this is the, traditionally this means enjoyment and, and group activities, but I think it has to do with a group of people that connected to this. So, so here what it shows, guys, is that it's very unpleasant what comes out. Okay, and what it comes out, it's this is quite interesting. Okay, this is fighting the child fighting or com competing. Okay, it could be competition or fighting um, through lies and deceit. There are meetings, I think, here. I think, guys, I remember one of the first meetings I did on Kushner that showed that, you know, this was in, I remember, like, wow, this is new at the time. It was like, oh, he goes to, to all these foreign countries not to work for the U.S., but to find business for the family so they could get these bribes. And that's what it shows, okay? So he goes, he he's lies, he has these seedful meetings, right, and abroad. He's go, he has these, like, shady trips. Oh, I forgot to get this last one here. Yeah, he's going to have to deal with some losses here as a result of of these. And this could also indicate, guys, the, the motivation. Because as you know, he had a lot of debt before he got into the government. So then he was trying to recoup these losses by going on these shady trips with the, with the excuse that he was working for the government. But he really wasn't working for the government. He was working to get himself some money so he could pay off his debts. Okay. And then we have here the family upside down the bribes, right? So there's problems for the family because of the bribes they have received. There's a change. It's, they have sad news for them. Oh no, really? You're kind? Why, asshole? <laughs> it's unpleasant. So this is something that he doesn't like. Really? You don't like? Huh? Why? Oh, wow. Oh, I love it, guys. Look, this is for Jarda. Oh no, sorry for him. So sorry. Oh no, look, you're sad? Because guys, this is no one I said before. This is the worst card ever because it's not only the burning building, but it's very upside down. So it's like the worst of the worst. So it's so like it's it's terrible. So what happens to him basically? We know that. Like whatever, who cares? Like these people, guys, you know, they really are awful human beings. I'm sorry. Not just awful, they really they have to totally empty inside. Okay, I'm so I, I don't feel bad for him at all. Okay, it's just that they, I mean, think about these people, they were willing to put children in cages. Like, and not only that, but, you know, it's like, not only they steal, they do all these other things, these are horrible things, but they put children in jail. Yeah, really? You're sad? You're not sad. No, you're not sad at all. But this isn't, you know what I mean? It's like, no, it's not sad. It's not even, it doesn't even begin. Okay, so this is it. So it's. All hell breaks loose. I mean, we know that, right? We knew that was going to happen. But that's what it shows, is that this shows that Mueller has, like, opens the lid on all their, the money they received, you know? Oh, look, yeah, this is interesting. So this is the guy with wine, right? So they're, they, this is like, this is Jared with a Kool-Aid bottle. I'm Jared. I'm drinking Kool-Aid. My family made my own Kool-Aid. And I drink it every day. Mm-hmm. So he was like, you know, drunk with power, right? So, so this is it. So then, so this is it, guys. That's what it shows. So the business deals and the gamblers, I think here, the gamblers meaning, he, I mean, I think he gambled with those buildings. You know, if he hadn't bought that stupid building, who cares? You know what I mean? It's like he could have had a, a new, decent life. He, he was, but it's like he was, he was drunk and with power, you know, and that's it. So that's what it shows. Everything's coming out. That's what it shows. Because he, so this is the bribes connected to Trump are going to be exposed. And the, the person who, it's almost like he's also the conduit for what this also suggests, guys, and something I hadn't thought about before, which is that he is the money guy for Trump. You know what I mean? Like, if you want to give money to Trump, find Jared. You know, so this is the, he's the guy with the money who closes the business deals, but it's all a big gamble. He's betting, you know, he bet and lost. But it's like, yeah, he only bet his country, right? Very minor. So, 
So this is it, guys, okay? Anyway, so this is it. So that's Jared. So essentially, all the business deals are discovered. I mean, we know that, but it's 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 like over for him. Oh, no. Really? Oh. Okay. And next is, let's see, Don Junior. Yeah? Because as we know, guys, we th I think that the next people are going to be either Don Jr. or... Well, let's see. I think... You know, I have a sense, guys, that Mueller is going to surprise us. Uh-oh. Don Jr. Look, just this upside down first card. <laughs> really? Oh, no. Wow, guys. Look. Bing. Full ending. I got just this upside down. I had a pain. Full ending. I got justice upside down. Bing. Full ending. I got justice upside down. Oh, yeah. Ju this is justice. Justice is done. Yeah, this is looking good. This is looking good for him. Just three, first three cards, okay? Yeah. Mm-hmm. So, so it's bad for him. Let's see here. Yeah, this is everything famous. Becomes famous, yeah? Mm-hmm. Becomes known. Comes to public. Oh, 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 guys, look, poor thing, the side. Oh, 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 no, oh, no. So, this is bad, guys. Oh, my guys, it's kind of sad, guys. Look, there's swords, all weapons, right? Ten swords and then a scythe. It's kind of creepy, actually. It's kind of weird. I'm like, uh oh, is it going to have that or something? This is loyalty, so interesting. God, a sudden fame of the, the, the yeah interesting we'll see let's see this is let's see how it you know it is kind of strange okay this is the young woman or it could also be lifestyle okay so let's see work for lifestyle yeah we'll work for mm, this could be yeah, this usually the help is on that would be him could be somebody else Okay, so just one more here. Yeah, so this is the vision. Okay, she followed their vision. The White House, okay, or it could also be the, I think this case is the White House. Or it could also be the family, okay, since it's a house and I have a real estate business. Grief and adversity for him. Yeah, everybody knows it's bad for them, but oh, I'm so sorry for you. Yeah, the Russia stuff. So the White House finds anybody. Oh, it also could be the family because it's both house and family. So the family finds grief and adversity because of their connection to Russia. Oh, no, really? And it's like you should have thought of that. You know what I mean? This is thoughts, ideas. He's, he's thinking about it, yeah? Money, some money because, yeah, he believed. Be, okay, I feel like he got the money from them, so he bought into their ideas. You know what I mean? He's ex this is exposure as an enemy. So he worked for the enemy. We know that. That's not new. Okay, this uh, you know, as you know what I'm like, oh woman, oh oh look, negative, negative, oh negative, yeah, negative messaging. It could very well be <clears throat> that off. Okay, so Yeah, very, see, everybody gets this, you know, guys, they, everybody gets these the similar expression. They receive a letter and it's really sad. So, in private, private communication. So, yeah, so I think they, it, it indicates the same thing. So, painful ending, sudden cut to the work for the, the family. Yeah, so he's removed because the work that he did for this, the house, also the family, right? So, all the, there's a painful ending because of the work. He did for his family and the little money he made, he received, this is he, him receiving an indictment, right? So because, and it's, this is interesting because it shows that from his perspective, he's like, I was only doing work for family. Yeah, I was doing work for family. Yeah. So you see, he was, oh, I was only working for my family, but it's the work that he was doing for the family that ends him. Okay, clearly. It becomes known, okay, justice. It becomes very faint, you know, not only known, guys, but there's a sense here this is going to be famous or this is going to, you know, worldwide fame, right? Kind of, um, it's, yeah, this suddenly everything's going to come out. It's going to be a splash. This is the young woman. It's also wealth, okay? I think this is just working for the facade, okay? 
And then this is interesting because this is the vision of the dream. So like I said, whoever gave him the money, right, who gave the lifestyle he worked for. So he bought into, like I said, you know, we know he's not very smart, but he bought into their platform and he bring he gets grief and adversity as a result. And he's thinking, and, and see, again, this is interesting, this whole thing of ideas. He's totally manipulated, okay? He has no ideas of his own. It's pretty obvious. And here we have the messenger upside down. So as we know, he was the guy who was connected to um, WikiLeaks, right? So, you know what I mean? So this is interesting because you, you receive the messages. Infamy, that's right, Holly, exactly, infamy. So... So he, you know, the ideas and all, maybe the idea, you know, could also be the the bots, you know, it's something that is about sharing the ideas or the message, sharing share the negative messaging, right? So, so then we have finally have the justice. This is again, the woman with justice to the loyalists. Okay, but also good people and him. Okay, I think the part in him. And the connection to Russia, the foreign power. Then we have the exposure of the enemy and the private messaging. Okay, the confidential messaging. So that's what it shows. Okay, he's, I feel like so far everybody's I, it's like Oprah, you were indicted, you get indicted, you, 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 everybody. So, so sorry for you. Yeah, I'm so sorry. So, okay. Wow. So, okay, guys, I don't know, you know, do you, okay, now, I don't know if I move on to the, okay, just, if I move on to, I feel like it's, you know, see, everything here seems really final, you know, I don't know if I want to do, okay, let's see, now, let's see a Deutsche Bank, okay, I want to figure out about the Deutsche Bank, let's find out the word Deutsche Bank, okay, <laughs> okay. Well, this just mean that there was this uh, raid of Deutsche Bank. Is this related to the Mueller investigation and Trump and his children and Jared and all those people? And also, you know, guys. Uh, yeah, I want to. I'm trying to think here because I want to know also about Justin Kennedy. But do I ask about Justin Kennedy separately? Well, let's see. OK, is this about Trump? And it, let's see. Mm. Wow. Interesting, just because, guys, the devil is ex so all the deceit is exposed. This creates the defeat. Okay. And then we have. A beginning energy here so this is the beginning of the end could be okay we'll see deal okay this is network could be the internet but also group of people in our society so i think it could become also it's in the public eye the deal come comes to the public eye and this is important very important deal okay then, oh my God, this comes so much grief and adversity again. The White House is very sad. They're crying today, huh? They are having meetings. Okay, this is meetings. War could be related to the meetings, the sadness. A long way. That's right. It goes way back. They go way back into the finances. The military law enforcement. That's why right, the raid was with law enforcement. It's like they 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 thought Mueller. They was just nothing about it. Nothing about it. This is Putin, guys. Remember, I say this. Usually, this is something becoming known, but I usually see this card in specifically as connected to Putin. Okay, so they go way back to find his connection to Putin. Okay. Then we have here. Look, presence. The gift, right? So exactly, this is a quid pro quo card. You receiving a gift, and the quid, you know, they find the money. Oh, look, this is the the handshake, right? So there's a deal. Now, either that the handshake is there's a shady deal here, 
or that things didn't quite work so well. Let's see. Yeah, this is tenderness. So everything cooled off. Now, what it shows here, guys, I just need, because it these two cards are somewhat related, meaning this one is warmth and this one is, is shaking hands, but things kind of go sour. And sour right before putting here. So this may, okay, let's see here. Yeah, this is shit gets real, right? So this is the longing card upside down. It gets real. And, oh, Trump. Yeah, this is the baby. Baby gets real. Raisin. Baby gets real. Now, this is interesting. Yeah, business partners. So this is it, guys. Okay, this is over. So they're discovering. This is, guys, could also be the internet, okay? But I, not the internet, the, um, yeah, um, social networks. But I think essentially this has to do, I believe it's society. It become, comes to the fore. Everybody's talking about this in public, something connected to the White House, law enforcement. And this is the shady handshakes behind the scenes of Trump, right? So this is the evidence of the deal. And this is causes defeat. The deal, this could also be about the election, although there is no election card per se. Could, we'll see. This could mean that it, the deal causes defeat for Trump, but also that that's how he created defeat. There's a reef in adversity right next to the White House a long time ago, a long way. The month, you know, the gifts they received, and then everything gets real. Meaning, I think finally the truth comes out, it gets real in every new beginning. I think a new beginning, something really important comes out about their meetings or their connections here and, and the connection to Putin and the cool the cool off. Now, the Putin connection cools off. Like I said, I think this may, means a moment of real goodbye here. And all of the this is the marriage, but it's the partners. So all of Trump's business partners and how he made his partnerships, okay? So, so this is it, guys, you know? So, so this is it. Okay. So, um, so this is it guys, you know, it's, it's really interesting here. I, I not, not that I was expecting anything, but it shows that this thing comes up, comes out. Okay. About how he made this deal and how his business partners, how the quid pro quo happened. Okay. And how far back it went and how this is the, probably the money was distributed, but there's something here suggesting that the Deutsche Bank thing is really a big deal. For and maybe this is how the money traveled. I don't know. We don't know exactly. Okay, but now let's see in general how the how is the Deutsche Bank thing related to um how is the Deutsche Bank thing connected to the to the family? Okay, how is this? I know that Jared is screwed and everything. So how is this going to impact this whole raid of the Deutsche Bank? Does it impact Jared Don Jr.? I don't know. What they'll do for each one, but let's see about the family message. Okay. They're making a decision. Oh, well, yeah. Oh, interesting. This turning the world upside down. Okay. Oh, a letter? Did the letter? Yeah. Now, this could be about voting, guys, because this is corrupt. It could be corrupt data. We'll see. Yeah, this is interesting. Behind the scenes, part of like how they, you know, there's something here. Something again. Everything comes coming up. Everything becomes known. Oh, wow. It's very similar. Military, again, the law enforcement makes something public about the Russia stuff. Okay. Then we have the work. They've done together works. Oh, look, prison. Yeah, this is the family. Yeah, there's a law enforcement is prison because the work you did is shady. Okay. And then, like I said, the, it's interesting because the vision, it's coming together with the, the lady Russia stuff. So, they're fulfilled. They are really doing whatever the vision of Russia is. And this is clear, but the way the cards put it is interesting. And the, this is interesting, the protector, the wealthy man who bankrolls them, right? So this becomes clear that he was working for whoever paid. And this is somebody has to leave. So they, they all leave, guys. This is like interesting because it shows that law enforcement puts him in prison. They kind of we are removed from the public eye. Yeah, this is the this is the connection to Trump, right? So Trump is the is exposed the con artist, the strategy. So this was the strategy, right? So they got they got to follow. They have information about the meetings and how the meetings connect to the strategy. Oh look, and then all the their crimes are exposed. So this is the guys. It shows that their mo 
okay, their ammo is exposed, okay? So this is really good. I think this is really interesting. So so this is it, guys. I think I got enough. I feel like, I, oh, this is the other thing. I, this is the last question I have about Deutsche Bank and then to the Chicago thing. Um, is Justin Kennedy and just Justin Kennedy and Justice Kennedy, is he connected to this raid somehow? Did he love, like, what? I want to know, is this, is, is he involved in this somehow? What is the connection? Okay. What is, is, is this connected to Justin or Justice Kennedy? Compromised. Okay. Now this is shady. Yeah, let's see. Let's see what else they say. Well, this is, I, I see this card is frozen money, frozen something. Cover circles. Transfer is interesting. Let's see. Foreign travel. Okay. Baby Trump connection to one power. This is court. And this is a question. Mm, so here, this is. Oh, oh, this is me. Hold on a second. I have to put gloves. Oh, it's about myself and my life. So now, this moment. As I remove gloves, it's too hot for me. <laughs> I'm here. I'm here for coming for people. Yeah. <laughs> this is me. So yeah, so here is my so guys, yeah, so yeah, so this is goes to court. No, this is one second, it still is not. Let's see if there are more cards here. Okay. False person connected to Russian. This is yeah, I think so. Yeah, yeah, so, okay, and then surprise, interesting, this surprise card comes up so much lately, I don't understand why, but yeah, this is the interesting, this is the law, also the, okay, okay, so just one more, Let's see here quickly, guys, intercepted transverse communications, okay, mm, business, yeah, so, Okay, so I think, yes, it's possible that he, because here we have, I, this is, I asked about this pretty much Justin Kennedy, okay? So here we have, there's these people who are not supposed to be celebrating, but, you know, the people who are celebrated, I think, are talked about. Now, I don't know if he talks, because this is a card of conversations or voices or something like that. Trump. So there's conversations of or about Trump. Then we have the woman here. I don't, I, you know, it's always open and open ended here. Who this is? This could, be, could also be guys. We, I've seen before how there is a woman. He, you know, they find blackmail. There's information, something like that. About this is the, this is the law, guys. But you know what I think? I think this is Justice Kennedy. I believe it. Okay, let's look at this card closely. This is woman of law. This is obviously some sort of very high level legal figure. Like I said, usually it stands for law. Right in general, but I I just believe I just think guys I really do that this is much more that this could very well be the way that they this because then we have the business upside down so some sort of shady business okay okay so this is it no no it'll stop, you know guys I I have to say this so you remember the reading is about I asked about Justin and Justice Kennedy it it's like it would be a huge extrapolation to be like bad no it's not bad. <laughs> Okay, I don't know what you're talking about, but basically this is it, okay? So so this is it. I just want to talk about it, okay? Just to say, I don't know if you're talking about the reading, but if you are, that's not her. We're probably not talking about it. But anyway, so so, so this is it, okay? So this is the business connection here. There's a shady business in the connection to the high high level law man okay and now it's interesting because the compromised money and the compromised people this is the long-term problem i think this is the money could have been frozen whoever whichever money came from russia and this is after the russia stuff okay 
And this is the man. I think this is him, Justin Kennedy. Yes. Okay. Then we have it's a surprise because this cut this stuff was caught. Now it's possible, like I said, there is some sort of money, like I said, financial transfer, shady money, fake, fake businesses, because you know they were creating these shady LLCs. They were this is all travel and transfer. So the shady connections behind the scenes to make these move financial movements. Then we have the court gets it. Muller's here. Okay, Muller is right next to the Russia stuff. And then and he's after the shady money, okay, Muller. Then we have this is like not so fun anymore, or whatever, you know, whatever. Um is just this is a very cooling, you know, very unpleasant thing. And the facade is showing, you know, so basically, guys, it shows that this is the moment of reveal. Okay. Moment of reveal where the stuff that, you know, as you, some of you mentioned, like we talk about it all the time, but most people don't, they don't know the depth of this. And so, and so it shows that everything is like exposing the whole thing. Okay. Very exposed. And so, and so this is it. It looks like definitely there's a shady connection. There could be the blackmail of, let me just quickly here. Tell me about, what about is, tell me about Deutsche Bank and what it's showing. Okay. Justin Kennedy, Justice Kennedy. What is this? All of it. There is a picture of, you know, showing here that there is definitely the, 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 it's showing here this glamorous image of all these parties, all this money and all the fancy, fancy things. And then they, they rip the, the picture, you know, the picture of the party, the glamour. It's all shows, it shows the, you know, the, uh, what is it called? The, uh, the visceral, you know, the, the insides. Okay. So it's really very corrupt. And uh, yeah, and it's really ugly. Okay. So, so what is the relationship between... Yeah, it shows this guy, Justin Kennedy, how he went up, you know, up the ladder. And he was, you know, he, I don't think they initially, well, he was not thinking that he was corrupt. He was just doing the job. You know, he came, he was well known. His dad was famous or whatever. And then. Um, yeah, and then it kind of, he got seduced by the lifestyle. Okay. There was, he seemed very glamorous, very nice, but it's, it reminds me of the time right before the financial crisis. Okay. The people, they were just very like, people got seduced by it and he got seduced by it and he made some, yeah, he's like, he, he, I, he allowed, there were some things that seemed shady, but he knew other people were dead, doing a few shady things here and there. Why couldn't he do something? So, so, um, so this is it guys, you know, I feel like this is the, I think it shows that this is the journey that he had. And then suddenly he finds himself, I don't know, it, no, it, it, I remember this, seeing this before and you read about him. I think he ended up developing some sort of drug problem around the time of the, the financial crisis, which is like, and he was kind of like, you know, like I said, he knew there were risks, but he's like, whatever. And then there's a connection here. I don't know that the money that they're looking at, I think, I think there are multiple instances because then it's coming to me, guys, and this is important. Okay, when you have so Trump, obviously he's a real estate person. So there are banks have these divisions that are about, about real estate. Um, that's the thing that happened here. That's a little bit strange is that he got the money from the private bank, and it's a very different division. Okay, it's almost like a private money lending thing, which is not how it is. So, so then. This is really unusual because, like I said, the, the people who lent him the money were not the people who are normally under the real estate. It's like the private banker is basically, it's the person who handles high net worth individuals. So they could find, you know, specific packages and how to explain it. It's a little bit like, there. it's just things that you do for people who have a lot of money, it would bring you money. So, so, so this is it, guys, I feel like, for some reason, I think this guy, Justin, there's some connection to it. I think he got some kind of like caught up in some corrupt things. And and in the end, um, you know, and this is the thing I feel like I've read so much about this, how and, and even um, Rachel saw, talks about it, how, you know, people are like the, the thing with the Russians, how they work is that they find people who are weak. 
you know, whether they have low money or they have, a, you know, some sort of problem and that they could be compromised. So this is what happened to him. I think he was like living in the fast lane and he came for money and nobody would, you know, he's the kind of person who to whom doors would open very easily. And then he kind of fell into it and then he realizes he's 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 caught. And because, and because this is very interesting, because then his dad is in the Supreme Court, then he's very, you know, it's very dangerous, right? Because if stuff comes out about him, it could affect. So then I think he's, his dad has known this for a lot, for a while. And, and he didn't think initially that there was anything wrong. Like, not that there was anything wrong. He, he thought they could kind of be removed or whatever. And then, and I think. With the Trump, I just feel like he was, I think Justice Kennedy believed that he was, he was protected in a way. Okay, but it, it just kind of came to him as well. The whole thing was, it's very, it seemed from what I'm understanding here, it's kind of subtle. It's not something that obvious. It's not like the movies, you know, see, I'm going to break your kneecap. No, it's a little bit like they come to you and say, hey, I, I heard you had some photos, huh? Something like somebody says something to your face in a way that seems like weird, but that makes you feel paranoid, but it, nothing is very direct, but it's just very effective, it seems like, okay? So this is it, and I think the, the son wanted to, um... no, I'm not saying, you know, I also worked in, in, in uh, different banks, but I, I'm not saying, I'm not, I'm not saying, guys, you know, that this is not, has nothing to do with, um... I'm not saying that somebody is a bad person or whatever, but I just feel like this is the situation that I'm reading the cards. I'm not saying that all banks are terrible, but, but, um, but, um, it's just, it is what it is, you know, and, and, and let's get real. If it was, you know what I mean? It's like, I know the same, like, but I feel like I was not working a high end division, but I think we hear all these stories. For example, if you're, if you're familiar with this woman who was, um, I knew her because she was married to Russell Simmons, the, the hip hop person. Uh, what's her name? She's half Korean. Half black. What's her name? Kimora. Kimora. She married this guy from Goldwyn Sachs. Okay, recently actually, and uh, and this guy was in Malaysia. I think Kimora. That's right, in Malaysia. And it turns out he was part of this huge scandal. Goldman Sachs was part of this huge scandal with like allowing the you know the corruption, trans like laundering money for this guy in Malaysia and it turns out this guy who you know was a very high level investment banker who had married Kimura then got into serious trouble and he's co collaborating with the government just to tell you you know that it's like it's very insidious because it's very high powered and then it's the lines are you know very thin here not you know so I, I'm not like I said I'm not saying that investment bankers are bad people whatever it's just it's fact it's a fact right so so it's kind of like it's not right so um so this is it. All right. So, so guys, you know what? It's so interesting. I, I have the same feeling about everybody here. That is just the unmasking of all. Mueller knew about it all along, and then it's the unmasking. Okay. So Kennedy. Okay. So, so okay. What else? What else about Kennedy that we should know? And also Justice Kennedy. What What is the connection? Is this connected to Justice Kennedy's downfall? What happens? There was a lot of, oh, they were really, they were really, I think, blackmailing the son, the son and the sons. I think the son and the sons both, okay? So, so this is it, okay? And, uh, and I think this was, this to me was like a, a you know, it was like a, a snowballing, okay? It was a snowballing of events. And, uh, yeah. And it's it just like, it kind of grew and it's became a, it's like a, it's like so much pressure inside on their minds. Okay. It's interesting. I didn't realize it. Okay. How it is, but that's what it looks like to me. So, so this is it guys. I feel like it's going to be okay. So how is this going to come out? The whole thing of the black males at some point, all of the, there's going to be one indictment where the black male stuff is going to come out. Remember how I was talking to you about yesterday. There's going to be a night where, where uh, a night, you know, an indictment or something where all of it comes out. Okay. So it's interesting. I just interesting how how it is. By Terry. Okay, so yes, yeah, so it's interesting. 
So it's just part of the game. It's a very big game. It's kind of like the whole thing is being lifted. Like I said, Mueller knows this stuff, but it's a matter of revealing, okay, how he's going to reveal this. Okay, so next, let me. we have to move because now we need to ask about the Chicago thing, okay? So what is this place that's Chicago law firm that was raided today that did Trump's taxes? What is that? Trump's business taxes, not personal. But So let's find out, okay, what is the connection here? What is the connection? About the, is there is there a connection? Interesting. Okay. This is temperance balance. This is aggression, and this is children. So let's see. This is interesting. Let's see how, what it said. What else? The woman. Okay. Power. Interesting. Powerful. Russians. Let's we'll see. Let's see one more here. Yeah, this is the foreign. So this is personal money, okay? Person, also personal money and power. And uh, yeah, this is like the yeah. This is probably helped. There's something here that helped money laundering. I don't know. And I think this whole there was also this. I read something about how there was some sort of a bribery thing. Okay, so this is what's this person more? This is Mueller right here. So I think Mueller is looking into some stuff related to Russia. Yeah, again, this is the gifts. So there's some weird ways, some some crazy financial issues, guys, expecting or waiting. So this is interesting because I think this is the could be the children, but also that the schemes. You know how the okay the guy, you know the guy Alan something. I forgot his name. Alan something did that. It was like he was he's already gave information to them, and then. And I, because it's coming to my mind now. And so I feel like it's the very convoluted ways that they found. It's like the schemes they use to not pay taxes, basically. It's big, you know, could be, I think a lot of wealthy people have, you know, complicated tax schemes, but some of this is not actually legal. This is deal. Okay. Change. Wow, again, coffin. <laughs> really? What happened? While wow, money losses, so lose everything. Oh no, really? Yeah, he will lose everything, but mm -hmm. wow, this is the flatterer. The flatterer loses everything. This is contempt. Now, this is interesting because if you could, the word contempt and law, right? So he was contemptuous of the law. Yeah, this is, I think, guys, you know, it's so interesting. This is Michael Cohen to me, okay? This is the, the person who had this information. I think Michael Cohen told Mueller about this. And then we have the meeting, okay? Again, the meeting. And then the treason. Yeah, so I feel, guys, essentially that this law, this is a balance, okay? If you think in terms of accounting, it's like how the balancing happens. Also, karma. So it's karma to because of the, the finances, personal finances, but it's also how he balanced his money. You could also see it this way, right? So this is how he received the money. There's a change here. This is the, and so, so and how these way, this helped improve his financial situation, Trump's, right? Then we have an ag aggressive towards the foreign power. I think it's the connection to Russia here. Mueller goes, if it finds the, here, the deal. The deal that changed Trump's life. And then whatever is connected to this is going to take all the money. That's it. Go by. Because, uh, because uh, Michael Cohen told him, this is Michael Cohen telling him about the meetings and the deals and how this is, it goes, the children are ha also something about concealing the children's income or something like this. Okay. So there's ways, of, like I said, something like that, another ending contempt because they're not following the law and, and the treason. So there's just so some way I feel like, again, this, this idea of like a complex financial scheme. Okay. So, wow. So, so this is a guys, you know, it shows, this is interesting, like how the financial scheme that was built to make the, the accounts appear legit. Okay. And then, but in reality, there was a way in which I think the money went entered. There's just something here. Okay, what is this? How how does the it looks like there's something foreign? What is the foreign connection to this place? I thought they, they just did a Texas. 
he found ways. Oh, there's something related to debt here. Like he finds ways to like make the debt not go away, but there's a way he the debt becomes. They receive the money to pay off the debt. There's just something where the debt is not debt, but it's a gift. You know what I mean? Something of like that. Okay, so this is interesting. It's complicated. I don't. How? Yeah. So it's just complicated here. It shows that, like I said, it's this weird. It's a scheme. Okay, and they were Trump was like he's bragging about how he has all he knows about all the loopholes to not pay taxes. He's never paid taxes. Okay. So, oh, guys, and you know something coming to my mind now? I have to talk about it. Maybe this is it. Do you guys remember? There's so much news all the time. Like a month or so ago, there was news about how Jared Kushner never paid taxes up until 2000, I don't know, 16 or something, 13. And how he did is that there's a loophole in real estate law that where you can claim the value, something like that. I don't understand exactly. So it, it's coming to me. So there's something like this, okay, where there's these loopholes and he never, you know, he claimed something that wasn't, there was just a complicated, you know, there's the scheme, something like this. So, so this is, okay, how is this, how important is this? Very important because the trick about money laundering, the trick about Trump is that he thought he mastered money laundering. He thought everybody bought into this. He's like, oh, this is him talking. Well, I, you know, I need money. They give him money. I gave him the best story they could have. I gave him a perfect person. I gave him a, a person who could really, you know, make it all seem real. I know how to make it seem real. This is it. This is real. This is real. Who, who's going to say it's not real? So, you know what I mean? So it's kind of like that. It's weird, guys. It's kind of like, um, it's, that's what it is. It's like, there's, like I said, there's something about the debt. Is pres- like that. It's not debt, but it's a way to get for them to get money. Okay, there's this is also the vision, but this is it. Mueller goes after everything. Okay, and this oh this is also how he registers. Oh, this is it because the guy registers their transactions in the tax. It's saying here, paying taxes is the, the one way that they couldn't lie because if it's a private company, there's some things you could kind of make up or whatever. But when you say something to the government is an official statement. So so it's kind of like um, it's the one legal. And, I, you know, as I was I remember I was watching the news, guys, I, re, I thought back of uh, about uh, Enron. And you guys know that it, when Aaron fell, Arthur Anderson also fell. Arthur Anderson used to be this very famous accounting firm, like a blue chip accounting firm. And it fell. Right. So so it's kind of like you need the accountant in order to create real you always need the accountant in order to to kind of like create a scheme because that's the person that's going to whatever it is that you do if you can't explain it in legal terms you're going to have to pay something you're going to mean but the accountant is the person who's the magician who makes it appear you know it's illegal of course but they make it appear oh no I'm so good. <laughs> you know you write it off but at this scale it's it's like i said there is a way in which it's I'm showing here being shown like these you know, um, these, uh, ch- you know, what is it? The, what you give them? I forgot the English word. Kandu. You know, the, uh, the water, you know, those round things, pipes, pipes, money pipes. That's it. Like this money, the pipe from Russia goes in, but the facade shows as a debt. This is it. But then the question is like, Russia is willing to provide the money. They just need a way way in, and the accounting is this. It's like, oh no, you can give it to me, and then I'll put it in pipeline. That's right, pipeline. So, see what I'm saying? That's a pipeline. Pipeline money for Trump is Russia, and he writes it like it's that. You know, so it's kind of like these banks that are, I'm getting here. Guys. These banks that accept money from Russia, and they, then they, they go like, oh look, I'm gonna give a, a a loan to Trump. You see what I'm saying? So this is interesting. They, like I said, you know, they transfer the money to the U.S. And then they say, oh, look, I'm going to get a loan from this bank. No, it's just a transfer. It's like a, it's basically a, a transfer, like it's transferring from one account to the other, but it's presented as a, as a, a loan. Okay. And it's like saying, yes, he had to be in debt because that's how he would never pay any, any, any taxes. He never pays taxes, never pay taxes. That's why. Because yeah, Mueller was like, Mueller, I see here Mueller looking at his tax returns. Ha, 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 ha. You know, they're like, ha, ha, ha. Because, you know, like, uh, guys, I don't even know how, you know, it must be very complicated, but they have to look, you know, I remember when I was working, whatever, in the banks, like, we had our PL, right? So it's a little bit like, I have to go to every line item 
And and if every line item is corrupt, it's a lie. So you have to go into, you know, because all you see when you see those, 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 those like say the line items or whatever, you don't, you'll get the big picture, right? But then if you have to look into the every, when you start to break down the items, then you're like, what's this? Oh, we don't know who, what well, it's like, it doesn't match. So, you know what I mean? So it's like, oh, it's fake. Oh, that's fake, right? So huh, when you start to dig to find out the connections, like where does this money, this number come from? You realize it's all fake. Oh my God, it's amazing. Because, you know, I thought it was like, oh, so complicated. Like, right, how do you, how do you have these things? But that's what it's showing. It's that first you have, let's say you have a piece of paper that's like the the tax return, but then you have to walk backwards. Now let's break down every little piece of this. It's like you have to really investigate. Okay, so this comes from this bank. So let's call this bank. Let's figure out who the person was who gave the loan. You know, so it's very intense, right? So, so this is it, guys. Okay, okay. So you know, guys, I kind of you know, I know it's not. It's like nine oh five, and Rachel starts. I want to watch a little bit of Rachel, and I feel like I don't know. It's so interesting. I feel like there's not today. You know, was, I feel like the revelations happened already in public, and now we had um. You know, this is more, yeah, forensic, exactly. So now we have, uh, I think we have this story, like that's the, the bigger picture. You know, usually it's interesting because I tend to find more details, but now I feel like it, it went, it showed that every, you know, it's all, the whole thing they want to hide. It's like, they, that's the thing, guys, Trump especially, and all these people, they thought they were so clever, you know. They started to, to like, they thought they were like, wow. We're so smart. We don't pay taxes or anything. But no, it's a matter of like you lifting. You lift it. And you. if people who are very, you know, those people who work for Mueller are very, they supposedly that guy Andrew Rasmussen was a genius or something. You know, he's very, very smart. And then those people are going to find where the money comes from. And if you, you know, it's like it. you have to explain. If you don't explain, you go to jail. And eventually you find where the money comes from and, and they're hidden. You know, it's like nobody, the truth cannot be hidden for so long. Eventually it comes out. Even if it's complicated, even if it takes a while, even whatever, no matter what, the truth is very easy. So that's what it shows, is that ultimately the scheme is revealed. You know what I mean? I almost am like, oh, it's not, because I feel like this is what it shows, is that what they really feared, what they didn't want us to look, right? So, <clears throat> so that was it. It was just like, it's, it, it came out. So now what are they going to do? They can't do much. So, okay, guys, so tomorrow, like I said, you know, it was a nice talking to you. So, yeah. No, you know, don't worry about it, guys. You know, don't it's like a worse, it's like a, He has protection, I'm sure. You know, he's not like, oh, I'm going to go, I'm going to go around, take a trip. No, he's, don't worry about it, you know. Don't get into fear mongering and don't worry too much, okay. And then I was going to say, so, so guys, tomorrow, like I said, I have, I have something in the evening, so I'm going to have to do the reading much earlier, two, two hours earlier, but I want to do it because I have a feeling and Miss Mystery was telling me this. She has a feeling that something big is coming and it's possible. Okay. So I really believe that it's possible that tomorrow is a big thing. Okay. Tomorrow, maybe, maybe, you know, tomorrow is we're going to find out the Manafort. He lied. What did he lie about? I think we're going to come out. We're going to find out. So I expect a lot, okay, to to um to do this, okay. So, right, all right. Oh my God, guys. So anyway, so this is it. I'm gonna stop for now. And tomorrow, tomorrow we have. I didn't. Anyway, you know, because no, but nothing happened no more, no more. So I have. A, I'm going to eat president. I have president roast, roasting him a moment. <laughs> So good night, guys. Good night. See you later. And I have let's let's hang out tomorrow. We enjoy Rachel Amado. <laughs> Eat president. Ah. <laughs> All right, guys. They, it's just rose. Yeah, I saw, it's a rose neft. It's an oil company. I'm a rose neft. Rose neft lady. Woo. <laughs> president. Ah. Got eaten by Jonas the lion. Zadara got eaten by Jonas the lion. See you later. See you tomorrow. <laughs> okay, good night. Bye.